In this video, I'll show you how you can create this logo glint animation in HitFilm Express. In this example, I have created this logo glint animation on a text. And uh, I'll be showing you how to do the same effect, how to create the same effect on a logo. It's really simple. Uh, first of all, let's create a new composite shot. And I can name it whatever you want. In the template, I'll choose the 1080p full HDI 60 frames per second. And let's change duration and make it 4 seconds and then click on OK. Let's create a background for our animation. So let's click on new layer, then click on plane. I'm just going to rename this to BG and uh, the color is going to be black and then click on OK. Now import your logo. I'll be using this logo right here. Let's make sure that your logo is transparent as a transparent background. And um, yeah, uh, once you have your transparent logo, you are good to go. Let me just scale this down a bit and yeah then uh, once you have your logo in your composite shot or in your timeline just simply duplicate this logo you can hit ctrl d on your keyboard or right click and click on duplicate and uh, select the highlight the first layer and uh, then select the rectangular mask tool and just uh, simply create a shape like this and then uh, you'll have this mask right there just expand it then expand the transform section and uh, let's change the rotation so let's rotate it uh, by about 30 degrees and also we will just reposition it and uh, maybe move it down to about negative 430 let's create a keyframe at our beginning at the beginning of our video and uh, let's move two second forward and uh, simply move this mask to the right side of your logo and uh, let's see if this is looking fine and you can also maybe let's uh, let's move it down a bit more like uh, right there and I do the same thing to 446 and uh, yeah, there we have it. Uh, then uh, all you have to do is go to the effects tab, search for fill color, and apply it on your first layer. On the left side, you have this fill color expanded, and then make sure that the color is white. Let's change the blend amount and make it 40%. And then you can see and just play this animation, and uh, there we have it. And uh, that's how you create this logo glint effect. I hope this video was helpful. If it was, please do hit the like button and uh, subscribe to this channel. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace.